Great news. Starlink systems and infrastructure continue to improve and grow. Here's the latest news from Starlink regarding their efforts to improve service quality. Space lasers. Yes, space lasers. Starlink will launch upgraded satellites in the near future containing space lasers. These lasers will enable satellites to transfer data satellite to satellite, removing the need for ground station involvement. Space lasers will make Starlink one of the fastest systems available for worldwide data transfer. Starlink uses a cell phone tower idea. A new feature enables Starlink to seamlessly switch to a different satellite if communication with your current satellite is interrupted. While Starlink can only connect to a single satellite at a time, this will allow it to choose the best satellite, resulting in fewer communication disruptions. If you saw my video on Dishy shutting down at 122 degrees Fahrenheit, then this will be of interest. Starlink has created a series of software updates changing how Starlink reacts to a temperature above 122 degrees Fahrenheit. These improvements will roll out over the next few weeks to resolve the thermal shutdown app alerts seen when reaching temperatures that tend to kill humans. Starlink App Upgrades Starlink recently released app updates that allow users to make network name password changes, enable WPA3 security, and separate control for 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz. As you might have imagined, Starlink now has orders from almost every nation worldwide, but Starlink's ability to expand service is dependent in part on approval of government licensing internationally. That's the latest update. Please mash the thumbs up. It helps a lot. Please subscribe to help the channel grow by mashing my face floating over the lake. And if you are anxiously awaiting a shipment from Starlink, things are slowly improving and expanding, so don't give up hope. Thanks to the dedication and skill of the Starlink system team, things are a lot better than they were two years ago. Never give up, never surrender. Thanks for watching.